Who Am I? Rogi in the Land of Polygons. A short story written by Carolyn Marshall and used for everyone's amusement in Mr. Lombard's 7th grade math class. Enjoy! Rogi was sad. Sometimes tears rolled down her little flat face. Why was Rogi so sad? Everyone in Coneville had a family. Everyone except Rogi. Oh, they were all nice to her and treated her kindly, but Rogi noticed that she was different. Her friends were all curvy and smooth, but Rogi was pointy. Ouch! Sometimes, when Rogi tried to hug her good friend Una Oval, Una said, Ouch! Very quietly, so as not to hurt Rogi's feelings. When she went for a walk with Cece Circle, Cece rolled along smoothly. Rogi went thump, 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 thump. She had flat sides. How embarrassing. Who am I? Rogi cried out one day. If you go to the land of polygons, you may find out, said a voice. Who are you? asked Rogi. I am the great geometry wizard, <laughs> said the voice. So little Rogi traveled uphill and downhill until she reached the faraway land of the polygons. The first polygon that Rogi met was sitting on top of a tall pole. He had the word stop printed on his face. Welcome to the land of the polygons, he said. What is a polygon, asked Rogi curiously. A polygon is a closed figure made of three or more straight sides, he replied. Some of my best friends are polygons. You look a little bit like my best friend Cece, said Rogi. Except you have flat pieces all over you, kind of like me. I'm Ali Octagon, said the tall polygon. That means that I have eight sides. I am also a regular polygon. All of my sides are the same length and all of my angles have the same number of degrees. You know, you're a polygon too. I am? asked Rogi excitedly. Oh yes, you can find some of your relatives down the street. Oh, thank you, said Rogi, and she thumped, thumped, thumped away. Around the bend in the road, Rogi came upon a curious little figure. You don't look like all the octagons, she remarked. I'm not an octagon, said the little figure, but I am a polygon. I have three sides and three angles. My name is... Trixie Triangle. Are you my sister? Rogi wondered. No, my sister's name is Amy Acute. She is also a triangle. All of her angles are less than 90 degrees each. My brother, Otis Obtuse, has one angle that is more than 90 degrees. Then my smart brother, Reggie Wright Triangle, has one angle that is 90 degrees exactly. We live in that beautiful pyramid over there. You might find your own relatives down the road. Toodles! The next polygon Rogi saw was not shaped like Ali Octagon or Trixie Triangle. But he certainly was funny-shaped. Hi, Rogi said. Are you my brother? No, sorry, grinned the lopsided figure. But I am your cousin. I'm a quadrilateral. A quadrilateral is a figure with four sides. Two of my sides are parallel, but they are not the same length. My other two sides are not equal in length either. Nor are they parallel. I'm Tommy Trapezoid. So I'm from the quadrilateral family, asked Rogi. You sure are, replied Tommy, counting her four sides. Well, Tommy, what is that string you're holding on to? This is attached to our other cousin, Katie Kite. She's checking out the weather. Rogi looked up, and sure enough, another quadrilateral was floating over their heads. Oh my god, hi, called Katie. A kite has, like, two pairs of adjacent sides that are, like, equal. Adjacent means they think they, like, touch each other. Ew. Also, one diagonal cuts the other diagonal in half. Awkward. You look like you're having fun, Katie, but I sure would like to know who I am, whimpered Rogi. She was getting tired. Totally. Well, I can see down the road, and here comes one of your brothers now, shouted Katie. Hi, my name's Sammy, said the neat-looking quadrilateral coming near. Can you guess who I am? I have four sides, of course, but my sides are all equal in length. I also have four interior angles that are all right or 90-degree angles. Oh, that's a hard one. Hey, can you help me, Tommy, whispered Rogi. Sure, Sammy's a square, answered Tommy Trapezoid. <laughs> yeah, that's right, and now I'll take you to meet our sister, laughed Sammy Square. He and Rogi went hurriedly down the road. Sammy and Rogi came to a brightly colored building, and Sammy stopped by the door. Well, here we are! But where's our sister, Rogi wanted to know. <laughs> I'm right here, silly, giggled the little voice. <laughs> 
Rita is working as a door today, laughed Sammy. See, she's a rectangle. A rectangle is also quadrilateral. Rita has opposite sides that are the same length, and all of her sides meet at a right angle. 90 degrees, remember? <laughs> yes, Rogi, I'm so glad to see you. We've been waiting for you to come to complete our family. <laughs> oh, now I know where I belong, and I even know some of the members of my family. But I still don't know what I am, protested Rogi sadly, as one tear tried to ooze down her little flat face. <laughs> well, let's look at you, began Sammy kindly. You have four sides, which means you are quadrilateral, like Tommy Trapezoid, Katie Kite, Rita Rectangle, and me, Sammy Square. Your sides are all equal in length, like mine, but you are not a square, because your sides do not meet at right angles, but you and Rita and I do have two sets of parallel sides. Brogy, I think you... I think you are a... Rambus! Shouted Rita and Sammy together. <laughs> Yes, and you and Sammy and I are all parallelograms, added Rita, because of our two sets of parallel sides. Ooh. Hooray, shouted little Rogi Rhombus. I finally found my name and home. Thank all of you, and thank you, magical wizard of geometry, Mr. Lombard, for helping me find my relations. The end.